Ladies and gentlemen, introducing our 2023 California Wrestling Hall of Fame inductee, Mrs. Sandy Bakoshi. Okay. Um, thank you first to Robbie for not having a speech prepared because as you didn't, I'm not quite sure what I want to say. I've been thinking about it for weeks, for months, as long as I'd known that I'd be here and have to dress up. Um, it's really humbling to be up here receiving this award for what I did in the sport of wrestling a quarter century ago. Um, I appreciate it very much, and to see all the names and all the people and hear all the stories have, humbles me even more, and I appreciate you all very much for what you've done. Um, I do want to thank the people who meant so much for me, to me in the sport. Um, you know, the, the medals, Olympics and going to the Olympics and um, wrestling, the world medals are nowhere near as important to me as the people that I met and the friends that I made in the sport of wrestling. I see some wonderful ladies in front of me who just make my heart happy. Um, where's Patricia? I, what Patricia's accomplished before and after wrestling, it just inspires me every day. You know, Shannon, um, Trish, Trish fought tooth and nail to give us opportunity. When I'm called a pioneer, I accept it. I try to be gracious about it, but Trish Saunders, thank you so much for fighting. I, I'll watch my language. For fighting like crazy to give us these opportunities and to give people like my daughter an opportunity to wrestle in college. I go to the wrestling tournaments now and I'm sorry, thank you to my daughter for bringing me back to the sport. She took me out of the sport um, my last tournament, I was pregnant with her, and she brought me back to the, to the sport when she decided to wrestle in sixth grade. And when she decided to wrestle, when she decided to wrestle as a preteen, knowing that she might not do it if I wanted her to, I just put my head down and tried not to say too much, but I was thrilled. And thank you for bringing me back to the sport and bringing me back to this community. And to my sons as well, C.E. and Sawane, thank you so much for your participation in the sport. Thank you for being amazing people, and I love you all very much. Um, thank you to the people in the audience that sat in my corner. Um, Dan Shade was in my corner, Horpel was in my corner, um, Mike DeRoe, Joe Corso, Roy Oliver for talking me to, into wrestling and giving me my first pair of wrestling shoes. Um, these men were people who supported us when it wasn't cool to do so. Um, now, it's much more accepted for women to be in the room, but they were the ones that were in our corners when, yeah, they probably got teased a little bit and given a bad time for being there to support us. Um, I had lots of friends, lots of friends, lots of laughs, and I appreciate you all very much. <sighs> and I want to thank everybody for what they do and they, what they continue to do. Oh, Mike Manning, I'm sorry. The one that brought me to San Jose State and brought me to San Jose to do judo. And he and his daughter are also wrestlers. His daughter is wrestling in high school as well. But um, I want to thank you all. I was thinking about being appreciated or being inducted for what I did as an athlete. And I thought about it, that was such a long time ago. Um, I hope to inspire kids around me, but it was a long time ago. And I thought, wow, I really appreciate all the people in the room who are inducted for their lifetime service, what they're doing to inspire kids and provide opportunities to kids. Joan, Andrea, thank you for what you're doing for girls. Um, but listening to all the stories of all the people who have been inducted in front of me, they're also giving back to the, support, to the sport, giving to children, giving to support and build people. And I appreciate you all very much. I'm humbled to be a part of this group, and I just want to thank you all.